uh, InnoFood Africa is funded by the European Union's Horizon 2020 Research and Innovation Program. It explores climate smart crops to develop and demonstrate solutions for cultivation practices, processing into food ingredients and food products, potential to reduce malnutrition and create new value chain for local and international market. The project also looks into biodegradable packaging systems. As part of InnoFood Africa, researchers and postgraduate students at the Department of Consumer and Food Sciences, University of Pretoria, have researched into the manufacturing of various food ingredients and food products, as well as novel ingredients for biodegradable packaging. Bambara groundnut is an underutilized legume that is rich in protein and minerals. It is an indigenous crop that is climate smart and drought resilient. The utilization of Bambara is hindered by the hard to cook phenomenon. Our processing technologies, namely infrared and microwave, produce quick cooking Bambara groundnuts. The cooking time is 25 minutes instead of three hours. Whole grain Bambara is rich in dietary fiber and low GI with other health benefits. Fermentation is a relative cheap, safe, traditional and household method used to improve the nutritional and functional properties of sorghum flour. The fermented sorghum flour can be used to make flat bread with enhanced platability, flavor and taste. The aim of my work is to produce expanded high fiber snacks from sorghum, a dry tolerance crop by stretching cooking. Here is an industrial extruder in which the sorghum flour is fed through the feeder. The flour passes through the barrel at different temperatures where it is mixed with water from a peristatic pump. As the flour passes through the barrel, it is cooked and comes out of the dye as ready to eat expanded snacks. The sorghum expanded snack is gluten free, hence a safe snack for celiac patients. The higher bran content without compromise on sensory quality will increase dietary fiber intake. Dietary fiber has various health benefits. In this project, convectional oven drying was compared with novel drying technologies such as microwave and infrared. The focus was to retain bitter carotene from orange fried sweet potato. The study has shown that by combining microwave with infrared energy, the samples retain more bitter carotene and dried quicker when compared to other drying methods. This shows that the novel drying technologies can be applied to reduce time and energy. We're manufacturing white sorghum pasta enriched with red sorghum bran and grape skin extracts to help improve the cooking quality of gluten-free pasta by extrusion cooking. Gluten-free pasta lacks the gluten matrix formed in traditional wheat pasta to give a good quality pasta in terms of cooking qualities. The work we're doing here aims to mimic gluten using climate smart crops and recycling material from the wine industry. The main aim is to produce low glycemic index flour from sorghum using heat moisture treatments by infrared and microwave energy. The sorghum varieties used are white non-tannin, red non-tannin and red tannin. The sorghum is heat moisture treated using a combination of infrared and microwave energy. The in vitro starch hydrolysis analysis to simulate what goes on in the human system is done. From the graph, it can be seen that the heat moisture treated samples decrease in the percentage starch hydrolysis, with infrared treatments having lower hydrolysis compared to microwave treatments.